we are making a wooden frame so that we can lay the wood inside. The materials that we are using are a big plank of wood and more smaller pieces of wood. Some of the tools that we are using are a saw, a hammer, an L-shaped tool and sandpaper. Basically right now I'm just I'm just pounding the bitumen so it becomes this quality. Why do you need that way? So that it'll heat easily. It'll heat easily and melt easily. It will be and we need to melt it in order to make the road. Okay. So when you got the bitumen, how was it? It was basically of many great big lumps of this size. Like you then have to further break down. Like this. Okay. This was one of the pieces of bitumen Bitumen and plastic are melting inside the pot and then once they completely melt we shall, add, we shall start adding the gravel in order to make it the same mixture as we had previously. Which also incidentally we shall be using as the top layer of our room.
mixing up the bitumen and the plastic. The plastic and the bitumen is practically melted. And now Saket and Dhruv are adding the gravel. So the gravel is uh, it's going to mix in and this is going to be the final road mixture. After it dries, it's going to look uh, somewhat like the mixture that we've laid out here already. It will look exactly like a road, yeah, without plastic. Even because Right now, we are emptying the the gravel and bitumen and plastic mixture on the actual road. This will create the road effect and it actually makes the top layer of the road. As you can see, we are spreading it evenly across the surface of our uh, structure. And now, it, once it dries, it will look exactly like a regular road. So what all is in that uh, material? We have gravel, plastic and a bitumen mixture, all heated. Good.